Welcome back, welcome back to another episode of HGV Talks. Um, I'm a little late on this week. Um, I think I'm uploading this on Tuesday? Tuesday or Wednesday? Probably Tuesday. Um, I completely just missed Sunday. I don't know how, but I just... It just completely blanked. I just completely forgot to do it. Um, no reason I couldn't have. I just was doing other recordings and editing stuff and did a stream, and then I just... Completely forgot to <laughs> go uh, to do this, the podcast. So, um, kind of scrambling to get this one together here. I had something specific I wanted to talk about, and I forgot what it was. It wasn't like a big thing, but I remember I was like, "Oh, well, I should I should write this down so that I don't forget." And I forgot. Um, uh, hmm. That's unfortunate. Uh, maybe it was something to do. I know I was thinking about starting to work on my car, the Subaru. So I know I was kind of thinking of like, you know, people giving me suggestions and stuff of, you know, the order of operations of pulling a motor from a car and like, you know, tips and tricks for helping with that. Um, I, I know obviously I got to like, you know, drain the oil, cool it, disconnect everything and remove pretty much, you know, alternator, AC, some things like that. I think power steering pump you could take off pretty safely. Um, just remove pretty much most of the auxiliary things that you can and then pretty much get all disconnected and whatnot. But I'll be, I'll be looking into that. I don't think that's what it was though. Uh, I'm going to go to the comments on the video because I know it was a couple of more comments on the video this week, so I wanted to check in on it. Uh, Perry said he's glad to hear about the new playthrough coming through. That should be coming on this week. Um, I'm just, I had the first episode recorded for Pokemon Yellow Legacy, and I'm excited for it. It's like it was super fun already just to get started, so I wanted to do that. Um, oh my god, it really, it's bugging me that I had something I wanted to talk about, and I completely blanked on it. Oh, man. Can't think of it. Um, But it'll be going up this week, hopefully. I think Ryan, my guy who does, like, all my editing and stuff, he he said he just, like, blanked. He was, like, he, I told him about it, like, last week at some point. I was like, oh, like, he usually does stuff on the weekends. So I was like, you know, this weekend when you get a chance, if you could do a thumbnail thing. And then I was actually asking him about something completely unrelated, and he was like, oh, I completely forgot that I didn't do that. Uh um, the thumbnail for it. So he said he's going to get on it when he can. So hopefully it'll be up this week. Um, definitely looking forward to doing a solo series. Those are always fun. I'm getting a new PC. So this will be the last podcast recorded on this PC. Uh, you probably won't notice any differences in the quality of a, you know, podcast. It's going to be the same camera and same microphone and everything. I just got to swap out the PC. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to want to do uh, a dual PC setup. I don't think I gonna. I don't think I want to. I'm probably just going to do one PC. I don't really run crazy games. I feel like the dual PC is not super necessary. I'm sure there's little benefits to it, like tips and you know little tricks that I could do that'll improve the quality of my stream. But I don't think it's really worth to run two PCs. So I think I'm just gonna set up this PC or put it aside uh, for my wife, maybe if she wants to get a PC set up so she can play some games on there because it's a much better quality than playing on the old Xbox that's upstairs. Uh, that's just coming in tomorrow. Well, today, when this episode comes up, it should be up, so I'm probably not going to be streaming. I've streamed pretty consistently. I feel like I've been taking a day off in a long time. What's the last day I took off? Let's see. Um, June 1st and 2nd, that weekend I took off. Yeah, I took that Saturday. That was last week. Last weekend, I took the Saturday and Sunday off. What did we do that weekend? Why was I busy? I know we had a party on Sunday. My niece, was it my niece's part? No, it was my nephew's. 
like first baptism or something like that. So we had that on Sunday. What were we doing on Saturday? Why did I not stream on Saturday? Hmm. I think I just like ended up, I hit up my friend and hung out with him for the day. Nothing crazy. Um, but yeah, since I went from June 3rd to the 10th, streamed every day, did a couple two days, two, two days. I did two streams. Um, streams has been going really good, honestly. I've been trying to do like, I've been trying, I like the three hour mark. Sometimes I've done a little longer, I had like a five hour stream the other night, hit closer to four, three and a half on a couple. I usually like to stay right around three hours. I feel like that's kind of like a perfect session for the Ironmon in the stream. I'm not sweating a uh, time that I'm streaming at. I probably should start getting back into figuring out a schedule for it because I'm kind of just all over the place and you know people obviously like to have an idea of when I'm going to be live so like know when to look out for it in case notifications don't work or whatnot but um I'm still just kind of streaming still kind of on the back burner in my eyes right now I'm still trying to just focus on everything else outside of that I went for a run just now just got home took a shower came down here to record this I went on a run. It was like the last weekend. I think I went for a run and I was crazy sore. I think I was talking about the last podcast that like, I was like surprisingly like sore. We were playing, like playing some basketball and stuff on Sunday. Went for the run on Saturday, I think. And like early last week, I was super sore and I didn't really work out much at all last week. And I did eat pretty good though. To be fair, my diet wasn't too, too bad. Did have a couple drinks on the weekend again, which, you know, I've been having, you know, I've been trying to obviously cut it down. I've been talking about that forever and I've been doing like spurts still. I'm doing it more consistently where I'm going like four or five days without a single drink, which surprisingly was rare that that would ever happen. Um, I'm still like on the weekends, you know, my friend's birthday was this weekend. So that's why we were at his house, had some drinks. Um, My sister came by with a billion cans of like white claws and beers and stuff. And I got a little mini fridge down here now. So I was like, probably gonna have a couple more random beers that I probably didn't plan on having, but, uh, I'll try to limit that. Try to get good with it. Keep the diet in line. I've been doing meal prep and stuff still. So I've been eating good. I cooked a bison steak yesterday and it came out so freaking good. I don't really cook steaks that often, but I cooked one like just in a, just a regular pan. Like I didn't grill it or do no crazy techniques. I literally just threw it in a freaking regular nonstick pan <laughs> and cooked it up. Came out like medium, maybe a little closer to medium rare. And it was freaking delicious. Um, I'm probably going to start getting more into steaks and making some good ones. Get people walking by my house. Um, but what else? What else? I'm look back at the comments. I think I missed some. I think I just started getting onto it. Um, Draco said the same thing. He said he's excited for the new series and the same thing with drinking. You know, it's just like, it's just not worth it a lot of times. Uh, so it's definitely something I'm trying to do. Um, let's see. Pi said people can play easy with fun. I'm sure. That's why playing video games for a living doesn't mean you don't work hard or inherent anxieties and certain associated with it. Yes. So, um, <laughs> and Benny said <laughs> streaming's the easiest job in the world. You just ramble for 22 minutes and you'll get a couple bucks for it. <laughs> I want to see something i was i kind of pointed out like in the last episode how you know I, I don't make a ton of money off youtube at all uh i don't nearly get the amount of views i wonder for my podcast because this is something i strictly just do for like myself i wonder how much i've made off of like my best podcast let me see can we get the playlist let's see what's probably my best one i had 195 views on this is the one that just came out, the one I talked about the bachelor party. Wow, I got almost 200 views on that one. Not bad. Let me see. Let me see how much money I made. I made one dollar and six cents. <laughs> That's my best podcast I've ever put out. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had that many views on one before. Uh, I had 148 views on this one from 2023. What was this one? 71 cents. Okay. That's my second best one. I don't think I've had more than that on a video on a podcast. Um, 
Oh, wait, actually, I had 273 on this one. Was this? Oh, this was after like a month off. I think this was this was after the subathon, the last subathon. Let's see what this one was. 73 cents. Okay. <laughs> if I make about 50 cents to a dollar on these. But it's... <laughs> hey, still an easy job. All right. Uh, was there something about... Man, there was something I wanted to... There was a question or something that came up. I swear I had like clearly in my mind, I was like, oh, I need to make sure I talk about this on the next podcast. And I completely cannot remember what it was. Oh, it's driving me nuts. I'm going to remember it as soon as the video is over. I already know it. And also Benny was saying, wonder if the moon black two videos did well, because instead of the title I did, like I switched up kind of more about uh, like bold statements. I do know that that's kind of like the clickbaity type of thing that you probably should do to get more views on your videos. But I don't know, man. I really just, I try not, I try to get a little better about making the titles a little catchier, but I also want to have like episode numbers in the video and stuff like <sighs> relevant to the series. And I don't want to like just make a clickbaity title every single episode. It kind of just drives me nuts to even try thinking of them. Uh, but the Soul Link's actually picked up a little bit. It's doing pretty decent. It started out a little slow, but started to pick up a little bit. It's doing better now. I think YouTube is just one of those things like the more consistently I'm uploading videos and keeping series going, the more the views like steadily go up. Uh, we got TikTok is getting very close to the 90, I think I had almost 9,400 followers now, which is really cool. I'm trying to hit 10K, but I am just slowly getting there. Yeah, we're at 9,379. Slowly but surely, getting there. Um, man, I'm sorry. I am. I cannot stop trying to figure out what it was that I was trying to talk. I was going to talk about. Uh, this is so frustrating. Oh, something I just found out today. Um, my merch. All the money I've made from my merch has just been sitting on a PayPal account, and I had no idea. I had no idea. Uh, so like when I buy merch, most of the merch like money I've made is because like when I do giveaways and stuff, I just buy them from my website because I know I don't have them like crazy, like overpriced or anything like that. It's like I could do samples and things like that, but I'm doing giveaways. I'm getting a bunch of different stuff. You can only sample so many items. They don't let you do like a ton of things. So I just usually buy them myself. And I just found out I have this PayPal account with like a bunch of money on it. It's not a bunch. It's like a thousand dollars, but it's after spending thousands of dollars on the giveaways myself, I thought that money was going into my other PayPal account. I didn't realize it was a separate one. So I was like, Oh shoot. It's a little chunk of change right there. So I'm going to have to figure out something to do with that. Um, hmm. man, I'm sorry. I, this is driving me absolutely insane that I can't remember what I want to say. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess this dude, I am sorry. I need to remember what it is. I need to remember what it is. It's driving me insane. What could it possibly have been? I remember like thinking to myself, like make a note of this because you're going to forget. And then I was like, nah, how could I forget? I'll definitely remember. It's such a simple thing. And then I completely forgot. It was not sports related. Celtics uh, won the second game. But it was nothing sports related. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. I'm just going to wrap this podcast up in a, in a, you know, in a haze. And I don't know what I'm talking about. But uh, next podcast, I'll have the new PC set up. I'll probably be talking about that and how it all went. Transferring everything over and getting it all set up. Um, I'm gonna try going for another couple runs this week, I'm trying to get more runs in, try to keep the diet improving and yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.